MK Tactical Modular CNC Gearbox Testifier 1. So as I kind of predicted, the piston shit itself, which is a bit unfortunate, but uh, that's just how it goes when you start pushing the limits of what these things can handle. So this is the second SHS piston that's done this. So what I've actually ordered is some purpose-built DSG pistons. Uh, they are coming from France though, so I'm guessing there's going to be a bit of a lead time on uh, when they get here, but they're specifically designed for DSGs and they're actually radiused in, the, in these corners. Um, they come with uh, either eight or nine teeth to suit whatever DSG you're running. Um, I've ordered the nine tooth, even though I'm running eight teeth um, sectors. I'll just grind out that last tooth off. So they should be here hopefully in a couple of weeks. So. Uh, that's what I'll be using. Uh, fortunately, there was no damage to the gearbox at all, so the gearbox is still in good, great shape. No damage there. Uh, the piston head. So I'm waiting on some um, nylon piston heads. Um, they're waiting at the post shop, so I should be able to grab them tomorrow. Tomorrow being Monday. And a nozzle. I'm still just finalizing the nozzle because um, I'm looking to try and Maybe look at a different style T-piece setup. Um, I'm not 100% sure what direction I'm going yet, but um, I'll get this back up and running tomorrow and then uh, post a better video of how uh, it's running. Um, what I might have to do until I get those new pistons is uh, just pick up a uh, 18 to one DSG and get this all running with the 18 to one DSG uh, with, with one of these style pistons and then when the new ones arrive what I'll do is I'll just swap the, the DSG gears out and um, run it at full speed because I'm a little bit hesitant with uh, the pistons doing this.